and your camera is not permitted anywhere on these premises. Well, I could contact you because I want to know about an international felon, ma'am. May I ask your name? So which elite prep school is better, Hawkins School or New York's Spence School? Well, um, certainly they both are going to cost you an arm and a leg, all right? Uh, Hawkins at 23, 24,000, Spence is at 36,000. But uh, to me, well, I went to Hawkins and they taught me how to give back to the community in different ways, which I did do. But um, really the bottom line, when you get right down to it, each school has its nuances. Spence has a, a couple of issues going on with the neighbors, this, that, and the other. But the main thing you need to be concerned about here is that Hawkins is better if for no other reason than the fact that it does not have any felons on its board of directors. Take a look. It's pretty bad when your own daughter publicly calls you a deadbeat. That's all I can say. Sad bitch. Sad bitch. serious situation. I went to prep school myself, and I know that uh, we wouldn't tolerate any people on our board, you know, being international felons, but Adam Klein is. So I'm just here to try to inquire about that, see if there's someone I can speak to about that situation. Um, I don't know. I'm going to find out. Huh. Good afternoon, Spence. I'll just sign in here. If I could ask you to put that camera away, though, we don't have that camera. And your camera is not permitted anywhere on these phones. Well, I could contact you because I want to know about an international felon, ma'am. May I ask your name? I asked her about the camera with the kids coming by. It makes yeah, me but that's nervous. not her point. No, I understand. Yeah, but her point was I couldn't contact anybody at Spence. It's like she doesn't even care about the international felon that's here. You know? And that's not cool. It's not cool at all. Okay. So, that's how they are. That's how they're going to be. I mean, I went to a top notch prep school myself. And I know I, I wouldn't. You know, just because it's financially expedient for them to have him on the board of directors doesn't make it right. You know, they're teaching kids to be felons, basically. You know, you got to who's your role model? The people on your board of directors need to represent, you know, role models, not felons. And not only that, he's got another daughter who he's got the mother of that child owing him child support. He's a multimillionaire. And this mother's trying to make a living, and he's got some shady lawyers in Boston doing their thing, and the judge might as well be bought and sold. And it's just, you know... And that's, if that's what they want on their board, Hold they'd on. be more than happy to stand by that. So I can, you know, put this and let them know. Thanks. Yeah, all right. Have a good day. As well. <laughs> 